As well as playing in the church, I was also sneaking out to listen to the music at the Blue Cat Club. Man, that black music just blew me away. Night after night, I'd sneak in and listen to the blues. But at home, my family would sing gospel every night. Mama and Papa on guitar, me on the piano, and my two sisters singing along. I'd come on home to, Man to, to Faraday, and I spent a month practicing my sermons with Mama. Then I started preaching. I was sanctified and preaching at only 16 years of age. Can you imagine that? But I was earning good money singing that honky-tonk music. And I loved those pretty young gals. Wild times. But I learned how to sing. I learned how to entertain. I also learned how to sin. You see, I was also playing piano at the local bordello. on the radio and I heard this boy called Elvis Presley. Man, he was really something else. My daddy found out that he was recording over at the Sun Studios in Memphis and he arranged an interview for me with a Mr. Sam Phillips. Well, when I met him, I, I let my music do the talking. Sam Phillips, he told me he didn't need no piano playing hillbilly. He said, rock and roll was about guitars. Well, I told him I weren't no guitar picker, but I could play that piano as good as Chet Atkins could play his guitar, and you better believe it. Well, we soon recorded my first hit for Sun Records, Crazy Arms. Ain't the word for the way that I feel That old storm I blew in this heart of mine Someday your crazy arms will hold somebody new But now I'm so lonesome all the time Oh well, crazy arms You're not mine, not mine, not mine All my troubled mind knows you To another will be wed And now I'm so lonesome all the time And I met Elvis he and I became friends. We had a lot in common. We was both members of the Pentecostal church. He'd invite me over to sing gospel songs with him. Man, that was a whole new world. A couple of days. 
There's been a whole lot of shaking going on around here all day, and uh, it's been uh, as a result of a fellow dropping in by the name of Jerry Lee Lewis. As you know, you young folks especially, there's a hit record right now called A Whole Lot of Shaking Going On. It's one of those songs where you kind of get the beat and the feeling, and nobody reckon nobody ever will, I guess. It goes by too fast. But here he is, jumping and choking, Jerry Lee Lewis. <laughs> that's me he's talking about there. Man, that show, that man, that song... Changed my life. Well, I said, come on over, baby. Oh, a lot of shaking going on. Woo I said, come on over, baby. Baby, you can't go wrong. We ain't faking. Oh, a lot of shaking going on. I said, come on over, baby. Oh, we got chicken in the barn. Woo, honey. They got the whole by the horn. We ain't faking. Oh, a lot of shaking going on. I said, I found them keys. Louder, faster. The women that push up against the stage. I look at them with their painted lips and flared petticoats. They were ready to follow me to hell. A lot did. I said, shake, baby, shake. Great balls of fire. You heard of that one? By Otis Blackwell. Caused a big argument between me and Sam Phillips. He writes the devil's music, Mr. Phillips. Making the devil's music for money? Why, why it's against everything my church has taught me. Everything my mama has taught me. Mr. Phillips, I, I can't sing that song. It's a song of the devil, and to sing it would be a sin. I'd go to hell. H-E-L-L. -L. Why, the Bible says, make merry with the joy of God only. I come in this world a sinner. I'm still a sinner. I, I want to be saved, Mr. Phillips. I, I, I want to be born again. I want to be made as a little child. I want to walk before God and be made holy. Jesus, heal this man. Cast the devil out. Drop it, preach it. Goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Jenny Lee Lewis has been labelled a cradle robber and baby snatcher at his opening British concert. Fans booed at his lacklustre performance. I married Myra, I didn't need no urging. I'm 13 and she weren't no virgin. You hear that, Myra? Can you imagine? A man of the world like me marrying his own 13-year-old cousin, finding out she ain't no virgin? I was the king of rock and roll. What could they do to me? Well, for one thing, they stopped playing the records. Then the TV stations banned me. Rock star Jerry Lee Lewis has been banned by America's radio and TV stations. The people of America and the church call us saying they refuse to listen to the music of a child molester. So I went on the road playing country. If I couldn't be a rock and roll star, I was going to be a country star. <laughs> 